most exciting day in quite a while. Mater's engine reveal is finally here. We're going to pick it up right now down the road. So there's a lot of reasons why we picked this engine. Stay tuned to hear all of that towards the end of this video, kind of the specs on the engine. We're going to go pick it up right now. But Mater, if you guys don't know, my 1951 Dodge B-Series Dually, CM truck beds, flatbed, UWS transfer tank, we got jaded green paint job. We've had this thing for about four months now. There's a playlist I'll link on the screen right now. From picking up the engine to the first time we turn the key and crank it up and drive it for the first time, you guys are gonna see everything in between. You'll be along for the ride the entire time. It'll be on the playlist, made or build on the channel. You guys will see everything. The fabricating from the drive shaft angles to the transmission we go with, which will be in another video very soon. We've already got the transmission picked out, but everything will be on the channel. So be a great time to subscribe huge progress for Mater today picking up the engine let's go get it New engines loaded up on the trailer. It's in a crate, so you guys actually don't know what it is, but a hint, you guys might have just saw something that has something just like it. We'll see. Whenever we get to the Twins house, you guys know Twins, Iron Ape Coatings and Fab is gonna be doing the engine swap for us. So we're gonna go over there, uncrate this thing, show you guys what's inside and where we got it from. Can't wait to show you. Don't wanna unbox it right here, obviously, because we're transporting it over to the fabricator shop who's actually gonna be doing the engine swap. We're gonna film everything and show you guys everything along the way. So let's go over there. Actually, we're gonna eat lunch first. We got Mike here with us, Dip and Diesel behind the camera. So shout out to them for giving me a hand. We actually have a lunch appointment um, over in a town next to us with another YouTuber, which we might bring onto the channel and make a couple videos with here in the future. So stay tuned for that. We're gonna go get lunch. Then we're gonna drop the truck off, show you guys what it is when we unbox it. Stay tuned. When the sun's going down, no stars in the sky. I'm gonna head down the road, across county line, where the roll of the smoke, they pour beer and wine, and hearts break on the jukebox, where the neon stars shine. Where the neon stars shine And the whiskey flows In the dark of the night Alrighty guys, so we made it over here to Iron Ape Coatings and Fab. We got Chase, Colton, you guys know them from videos a while back. We got a lot of stuff powder coated here, some engine work done. They're gonna be the ones doing the engine swap. They're just as excited as I am to get this engine in Mater. And they're gonna help us right now get it off the trailer onto their pad and we're gonna unbox this thing in front of you guys and show you what it is. I haven't seen it, they haven't seen it, so we're all really excited. Let's get this thing off the trailer. Of course, uh, Chase, you wanna say a couple words? Huh? Uh, just just as excited as you are about getting it put in there, uh, gonna be fun, uh, try to figure a couple things out, You know, figure out transmission issue and all that. So we're gonna get the transmission figured out in another video, but right now it's all about the engine. Colton, of course, you guys know him. They're twins, they look alike, so. We're gonna get this thing off the trailer, get it onto the pad, unbox it, and show you guys what it is.
went to grab the engine off and it started storming. Florida said, no, sir. It is storming, man. The engine's protected though, so that's good. It's raining really hard. So here it is guys, the 4BT AA air to air intercooled from 4BTengines.com, the Big Bear company. They knocked it out of the park with this build. There's a few different reasons, actually there's a lot of reasons why we chose to go with a 4BT. A few of them being one, it'll fit right in there. Two, the reliability of this engine, probably second to none. The simplicity of the motor is another reason why we went with this thing. Being able to Say we're towing a trailer across the country, which is the plans with this truck, make events, make shows. Say we're towing my 30-foot Gator made trailer. We need a part. Hey, you can find parts everywhere for this engine. And also, the reliability of this thing is just second to none. So the reliability, the size of it, and the simplicity of being able to work on it is some big factors why we chose to go with this platform. The OGs on the channel, of course, know Chase and Colton over here at Iron Ape Coatings and Fab in Bonfay, Florida. They've been working on my stuff for a long time. I definitely trust my stuff in their hands. And that's saying a lot because I don't trust a lot of people with my stuff. But it's going to be fun for them, fun for us, and fun for y'all to be able to watch each and every issue and the placements of things and motor mounts. And just, we're going to probably run into a lot of stuff because this is not an everyday truck engine swap. This probably hasn't been done. And if it has been done, it's probably been done only a couple times. So being able to figure this stuff out is going to be fun for both of us and Having you guys follow along the entire time is going to be awesome. From this engine sitting right in front of you to that engine coming out and this engine going in, everything in between. You guys will be caught up and up to date on everything that happens. There'll probably be a video out probably once a week. That's probably kind of how we'll keep it. Once a week, keep everybody engaged and keep this build going. And hopefully in maybe a couple months, have Mater with this engine going down the road. That's the goal, guys. So I'm going to leave it to Chase here in a couple seconds. Let him kind of talk about a couple things right out the gate that we're going to have to worry about. Maybe some fitments and different things that we're going to have to figure out right out the gate. So we'll introduce you to Chase. For those of you who don't know, Iron Ape Coatings and Fab, their information as well as 4BTengines.com will be down below. Big Bear Engine, great work from those guys. Can't recommend them more. And with that said, leave it to Chase. Talk about a couple things and how we're going to do this. All right. How's it going, guys? So just like Caleb said, putting the 4BT and old Mater here. Uh, first couple issues that we're kind of seeing here is going to be our motor mount issues. So what we can see, first there's not very much room uh, as far as the motor mounts on the engine he's got versus the engine that's in it. Motor mounts are all the way on the back, so we'll have to address that issue as far as how we're going to route the exhaust. Um, like you mentioned, went with a 4BT platform over a 6BT platform just as far as space goes. There's, it's just not long enough to fit a six cylinder in here. I mean, yeah, other than not, yeah. other than cutting the firewall out, and we didn't want to don't want to cut up a uh, pretty mint fifty one oh, truck. Yeah. <laughs> We're gonna try to cut as low as absolute possible. And a lot of these things, a lot of these questions are gonna get answered as soon as this engine comes out, like motor mount spots. As soon as this engine's out, we'll be able to actually mock it up, maybe place it in there, mock it up, and see how it's gonna work and then it'll be so much easier once it's already out. But a couple of the other things we were talking about, power steering is something that I want that wasn't in this truck, so we're gonna have to figure out that. We'll probably lift the cab up so we can finish out the frame and also get fitments for our transmission and everything. Adding this 4BT is just gonna knock it out of the park and put Mater over the edge, I think. Uh, main thing so far is we're just gonna have to get the old engine out and see what we're really working with. Also, our air compressor on the engine that's going to be fun to be able to hopefully put airbags and maybe air ride on the truck. So let me know down in the comments below what you think about our engine choice. 
I couldn't be happier with it. I know Chase is very excited. Colton's very excited. Colton's actually working on something right now, but you guys will see him in the next video. Next video on this truck, I'm going to be taking the old engine out and being probably ready to mop things up to put this engine in. So things are going to be rolling on the channel. So subscribe if you guys are new. Shout out to the Big Bear Engine Company. Couldn't be more happy to work with those guys. They really know the stuff over there. Small business, but big enough to take care of all your needs. They do industrial stuff, uh, heavy equipment stuff, and the everyday guy, weekend warrior that wants to swap and do an engine swap. They got everything that you need. Their website's right here, 4BTEngines.com. Link down below. Shout out to Iron Ape Coatings and Fab. We're going to have a lot of fun over here, guys. They're going to be moving into their new shop, 25,000 square feet. 23,000 square feet. It's going to be exciting. So we'll catch you guys in the next upload. We'll see you then. Peace. Hard thinking, old